guys, I am so excited to share with you today the latest product from Lego Education. The new Brick Q Motion Essential Kit is available starting today. And I was lucky enough in advance to test it out to see what it's all about. Keep watching to see how Lego Education's latest introductory STEAM tool helps build confidence with teachers and students through its engaging and hands-on activities. I'm so excited for this partnership with Lego Education. I love that Lego Education believes in the power of delivering playful learning experiences that bring subjects to life in the classroom and make learning fun and impactful. They have a wide range of physical and digital educational resources that encourage students to think creatively, reason systematically, and release their potential to shape their own future. All right, guys, so I am so excited to build this Brick Q Motion. And this particular model is the free throw model, and it comes in this booklet. So in this booklet, it has different models that you can build. I'm here by myself, so wish me luck. So this latest product from Lego Education, Brick Q Motion, just launched on January 4th. The solution is designed for grades K through eight. There are two different sets, one for primary school, K through five, called Brick Q Motion Essential, which I have with me today, and one for middle school, six through eight, called Brick Q Motion Prime. Students experiment with forces, motion, and interactions in the context of sports with lesson plans that showcase skiing, basketball, gymnastics, derby car racing, and more. All units teach physical science through sports and include lesson plans to easily incorporate into the classroom, teacher guide videos, student worksheets, assessment rubrics, and math and language arts extensions. I truly have a passion for playful and hands-on learning. I feel like it truly builds confidence and resilience in my students. As a first grade teacher, hands-on learning is used often in my classroom. And the reason being is because I feel like it truly builds confidence. And I feel like this product here teaches curriculum and it provides that experience of hands-on learning all the way through. Hands-on learning and learning through play is so critical, I feel, in this day and age. It's important for kids to try again, to fail and try again, because it truly, truly builds their confidence. I can honestly say, as I was building the free throw, I was starting to feel really confident in myself as I kept going. There were times where I misplaced a piece, I added the wrong piece, but when I got the right pieces, I felt so good. It just made me feel good inside. It made me realize that, hey, I can do this, and I was able to do it by myself. I'm a firm believer in building confidence in my students, and LEGO Education's products definitely do that. I love that LEGO Education provides lessons rooted through play. Did you know that LEGO Education has been bringing STEAM learning solutions to classrooms around the world for over 40 years? Wow! You can learn more by visiting their website at www dot legoeducation 
www.thepeachcoach.com. Guys, so finally with much trial and error, build and rebuild, it is finally complete. So here we have our let go education free throw. We put the ball in here and Three points for Miss May. So there you have it, guys. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so cool. You can adjust the length by turning this knob here. You can get as close or as far as you want. And we can shoot and score. <laughs> Not so much that time. I just wanted to show you really quick how you can adjust the height of the basketball hoop by you can press down, see how low it goes, or you can pull it up and have it go like as high as it can go. Is that not cool? What I love about this is the fact that it, your teacher support, it gives you the, you know, how to engage, to explore, explain what the kids are gonna be doing. And then there's even an evaluate and a self-assessment tool, and then different tips on how to model up the basket height the throw the diff distance the pivot so it's just a great tool for teaching force and motion and kids are having fun and a lot of times they don't even realize that while they're having fun they're actually learning and so i highly suggest this activity in your classrooms it will be great in partnerships if i had a partner here with me i think it would just be even better talking things out, searching and exploring and discussing together. I so believe in hands-on materials in the classroom. I think kids learn so much through play and I think that has been taken away in our classrooms. And I just think we need to get back to letting kids play and learn through play. And this is a perfect way to do that. So in the comment section below, guys, let me know what are some Lego education tools you use in your classroom to get your kids hands on and exploring and learning through fun. Thank you so much for watching this video. So I'll see you next time. Bye.